No, it's got to be pretty tough to be a diabetic at this time of year. Definitely. There's so many wonderful goodies everywhere, and it's tempting. Mark you know, it's got to be pretty tough to be a diabetic at this time of year. Definitely. There's so many wonderful goodies everywhere, and it's tempting. Mark Zimmer, the owner of the Great Impasta in Juneau Beach, knows a thing or two about temptation mm -hmm. and is here today oh. with a solution. <laughs> uh, yes, and I tell you, it's great. Uh, this here, uh, the pumpkin sugar -free, pie. Sugar-free. Yeah. yeah. Well, pumpkin is a great, um, it's a great natural source of fiber. There's about eight grams of carbohydrate in a half a cup. But half of that is fiber. It's undigestible fiber. Mm. So it's really healthy for mm, you. And not using a sugar product is great. So I have here uh, the Splenda, which is a sugar substitute. It's made from sugar, but it's a really concentrated sugar. So that's mm. all I can say about it. It's really, really right. intense sugar. It's very sugar. light. It's very light, yeah. and it, 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 uh, it measures like sugar, but doesn't weigh like sugar. But the bad thing is it's not in stores, is it? Not yet. It will not be pretty yet. soon. Yeah. But remember the name, Splenda. Splenda. Mm. Yeah. But if not, if you don't use that, you can always use your um, any dry artificial sweetener, you know, according to you know, one packet or slice. So uh -huh. we're going to make two pies today. Okay. If you're going to make one, you might as well make exactly. two. I know. I've always thought so. <laughs> but, you know, here's uh, pie pumpkins, and, and you could get them in the store. Of course, look at this. I had to erase a little bit of it. Oh, it's from, it's it's from, from, from Halloween. Halloween. <laughs> but uh, you slice them in half, put them in, on a roasting pan, put them in an oven for, um, I'd say, about an hour and 350, and then just scoop it out. But oh. you could do it with can. There's nothing wrong with that. But you have to make sure you don't get the pumpkin pie mix. Just get pure pumpkin. Pure pumpkin is, uh, that's all it is. The only ingredient is pumpkin. So this goes to food for families at the market. All right. <laughs> so good idea. What, what does that have in it? Sugar and everything? That has everything. sugar. That has that the has mix, the everything, the eggs and all. So okay, pure pumpkin is what yeah. you want. Um, now here I toasted uh, three cups of walnuts and a half a cup of almonds. Look at how nice and brown they got oh, the toasted. Beautiful. Of course I cooled them off, but they should be slightly warmed. And you're going to put them in the food process with a steel fitted blade. And we're going to process this and make a flour out of it. And I'm going to add also the other ingredients, uh, which will be one half cup of soya powder. You get that in a health food store. And that, again, is another good source of fiber. Look at that. And one quarter of a stick of melted butter. What you do is just throw them right in. There you go. Oh, man, throw that's it right great. in and just Done. pulse it a little. And of course, a little bit of the Splenda and a pinch of salt if it doesn't bother you. And We've just got like a minute left. Pulse that. OK, it's, this is easy. And then what you're going to do is just make your, make your quick little pie crust. Throw it right in. Oh, I yeah. made enough here for two. I'm going to get a little messy, but that's OK. Yeah, that's all right. And what you do is just like graham cracker crust. Mm -hmm. mm, yum. Okay, and just only better. Spread that yeah. around. Pat it down. Okay, pat it down. Pat down the sides, and then what you're gonna have your can, two cans. I got the two small cans or one large can. All right. Put in um, eggs, and you want to help me with that, John? All right. <laughs> you want to just Throw whip that a little? What do I have? Here? And we got two tablespoons of ground cinnamon, one tablespoon of ground cloves, Start. and one tablespoon of ginger, and a little pinch of salt. Mix that right in. Voila, that's it. And it's all done. Of this? Just mix that together. What all did of you that say cream. That cream. Three oh. cups of heavy cream. That smells good. I hope good. I got all the ingredients in there. Wow, yeah. That's it. That smells good. And this is going to make two pods. So now, it's, what you're going to do is bake this on 350 for an hour. Right. And it's, just take it out. It's a custard. Mm -hmm. It is not low fat because no, of the cream. No, don't ever buy anything low fat with this. Yes, you have to worry the about flour, the carbohydrate. So the carbohydrate. Okay. You know, anything white, the white good. sugar, white flour. Hey, guess what? They're Can't wait us to it's try it. To go. <laughs> we'll just keep eating here. It's Thank you for joining us. Have a nice day. Thank you, Mark. Thanks. We'll Looks see you great. back here tomorrow. Yum. Enjoy.